Prudent Media News. First, a look at the headlines. Lata Mangeshkar sung two Kokni song songs composed by Anthony Gonsalves reveals Lata Didi says would be happy if Gomant Vibhushan awarded to Ridhanath what second part of exclusive chat. Goa to strongly objects to centre's NCTC proposal, joins non-Congress state's lobby. CM Parikar says local police should be involved to conduct raids. Goa Lokayukta bill moved to president for final assent. Parikar says he has not violated code of conduct, challenges opponent to prove violation, election commission to decide on plea against Alina's induction on Monday. Goa Cricket Association awards over 10 lakh rupees in cash prizes for 2011-12 season. Upcoming cricketer Amok Desai gets highest award of 3 lakh rupees. Cricket Academy at Poruri named as Sachin Tendulkar Cricket Academy. And Balwinder Singh Sandhu advises cricketers to enjoy fitness training. Women cricket coach. Purnima Rao praises Goan girls for tremendous commitment. And now the news in detail. Lata Mangeshkar had sung two Kokni songs. Lata Didi has revealed it herself. Nobody knows about it and nobody heard these songs. Famous music composer Anthony Gonsalves had composed these songs for her. Lata Didi is ready to accept Gomant Vibhushan Award. However, she says she would be happy if it is awarded to Ridhainath Mangeshkar. She had an exclusive telephonic conversation for the special second anniversary celebration of Viva Goa magazine. Watch the second part of exclusive chat available with Prudent. <laughs> पर आपन कोकणी गाणी गायली नाहीत ना आजपर्यंत मी कोकणी गाणी गायली होते पण ते काय झालं सांगते ते त्याचं ते रेकॉर्ड बाहेर आलं नाही अच्छा आजकाल बघा गोव्यामध्ये लक्ष्मी नावाची मुलगी आहे हो हो हा तिचे वडील गोन्सालवेस हो तर त्यांनी इथं एक सिंफनी केली होती फार वर्ष झाली त्याला आणि ते सिंपली त्यांनी सेंट झेवियर मला वाटतं त्यांच्या इच्छा त्या चर्च मध्ये लोक वगैरे होते तर त्यावेळेला मी गोवा गोव्याची दोन गाणी गायली होती आणि त्यांचं आवे मारी या पण गायले होते पण ते रेकॉर्ड त्याच्याकडेच राहिलं अँथनी कडे रिलीज झालं त्यांनी ते रिलीज केलंच नाही आणि गोमंत विभूषण हा किताब सुरू के हल्ली मारियो मिरांडा जे कार्टुनिस्ट होते दिला गेला। अनिल काकोडकर जे भारत एक विख्यात साइंटिस्ट है पुरस्कार जर आप तो घायल संमति का You can read the entire interview of Lata Mangeshkar on Viva Goa magazine. Prudent Media will bring to you the third part of this interview on Monday.
Bureau report Prudent Media The state has taken strong objection to the NCTC proposal by the center CM Parikar who's back from Delhi after attending security meet stated that local police should be involved to conduct raids as otherwise there could be misuse of powers The non congress rule states are opposed to the clause that gives this power to the NCTC officials Meanwhile the Goa Lokayukta bill has been forwarded to the president's office for a final assent. President Pratibha Patil is scheduled to return on 8th May from her foreign visit. The central government on Saturday failed to convince dissenting chief ministers including some of the UPA on its proposed anti-terror hub. The chief ministers who had opposed NCTC notification in February this year stood their ground on two key issues: not having the agency under the intelligence bureau and against providing it overarching powers to operate in the states chief minister parikar also attended this meeting and cleared goa stand in principle we support the central government on terrorism issue tantani je bitar pe sarchan ye karpa ji power dilya taka sagani tarshan ani virodh kela no one was very comfortable on that amche manne gira ki tumi local police use kara तुमका के रेडी कंडक्ट करपा असो जल्या इंटेलिजेंस गॅदरिंग करा देयर वी विल सपोर्ट कारण की असा लोकल पोलीस घेतल्या शिवाय तुम्ही आता इन्कम टॅक्स असत डायरेक्टर ऑफ रेव्हेन्यू इंटेलिजन्स असत ते किती रेडी कंडक्ट करता लोकल पोलीस मदत करतले यांना तुम्ही करा पण लोकल पोलीस मदतीन करा तुम्ही तांका पॉवर देऊ नका मिसयूज जाऊपा शक्यता आयज न जात आणि थोड्या वर्षां जातली मीन वाईल Parikar said that the Lokayukta file has reached the president's office for a final assent. Lokayukta ji file president ja office ak pauli. President is out of country. She is returning on 8 ta janta follow up karun atam. Our reporter Jason Suarez with video journalist Tulsi Das Chari. CM Manohar Parikar has denied any violation of code of conduct by the government. He says he has not received any notice from the election commission. He has challenged anyone to prove any violation. Meanwhile, the EC uh, EC's decision on the plea against cabinet induction of Elena Saldana will be heard by Monday afternoon. CM Parikar is firm that he has not violated the code of conduct by announcing scrapping of marina at Sankwal. a regularization of malaria workers election commission of india will decide on alina's induction and the alleged violation of model code of conduct by monday afternoon the state chief electoral officer has forwarded the complaint filed by advocate iris rodrix in this regard to the commission meanwhile advocate iris rodrix has submitted a memorandum to the governor on sunday objecting alina's cabinet induction the chief electoral officer has asked the government to defer alina's induction after kortali poll It now remains to be seen what stand the newly appointed governor will take on this issue. Alina swearing in is scheduled to take place on Tuesday. All eyes will now be on EC's verdict which will determine Alina's induction into the cabinet. Our reporter Jason Suarez with video journalist Tulsidas Chari. It's time for a short break. Stay tuned.